Hey guys, what is going on? Brick Speedster here. And today we're going to be reviewing set 75199, General Grievous's Combat Speeder. This set came out in 2018 and retailed for $29.99, so a little on the pricey side considering it only has 157 pieces. Um, however, this set does include, include General Grievous, which probably did raise the price a decent amount. But without further ado, let's get into the minifigures. So taking a look at our first figure here. We have General Grievous. Now this set is based on a Clone Wars episode, so it is going to be the Clone Wars version of Grievous with his white armor instead of tan, uh, as seen in Episode 3. Um, this is the normal Grievous model, nothing new here. Uh, he has his uh, forearms with uh, white printing on each of them near the bottom. And uh, then he does have his dual molded uh, white and gray legs. He also has his uh, normal chest piece and his uh, normal head. Um, I mean... I honestly, Grievous is such an amazing character, uh, and in Lego, he looks, um, I mean, just as cool, um, compared to other minifigures, he does tower over them just a little bit, you know, not too much, uh, but let's look at Grievous with lightsabers now. That, you're gonna tell me that doesn't look sick? That looks awesome. I mean, just with the four lightsabers, he looks so menacing, honestly, a uh, fantastic figure, I mean, this is literally... The definition of a perfect figure to get in a Lego set. I, I can't think of anything else. Like, But yeah, that's going to be all for Grievous. Let's move on to our next figure. In our next mini figure here, we have Mace Windu. And uh, I believe this is an exclusive figure, um, being that it has an exclusive uh, like torso and legs. Um, I don't believe this one came in any other set. Uh, however, I may be wrong on that. Because this is my first uh, Mace Windu the, uh, minifigure, and uh, looking at it, I'm not I'm not really disappointed. It looks it looks pretty good. He has his purple lightsaber, you know, everything that Mace Windu has. Uh, so I mean, no complaints about him. Let's move on to the actual set. Okay, so looking at the actual set here, um, you know, it it looks pretty good. This is um from an episode of Clone Wars, and it does look uh pretty um, you know accurate to what we see in that episode uh however the first thing we have to ask ourselves is is this set worth thirty dollars and i'm gonna have to say no no it is not i'd say this is a twenty dollar set at most and i know grievous isn't it as like i said it probably raised the price a decent amount but ten dollars for grievous um, i'm gonna say no honestly I don't think that many figures worth ten dollars. I'd say five, sure. So if they wanted to make it twenty-five, that might be better. And I know five dollars doesn't sound like a lot, but when you see this, one hundred fifty-seven pieces, and look at the box, and you hear thirty dollars, it's. Uh, I mean, it's a no. Now I did not buy the set for thirty dollars. Okay, I did buy for twenty-three when it went on sale, and I was much happier with that purchase. However, I would have not been happy to buy this thing at thirty dollars, honestly. Um. I mean, you do also get, like, those larger kind of, like, UFO pieces on the side in a uh, darker blue, which is also nice. But, I mean, still, no, no, not 30. Not 30 at all. Um, but enough saying the negatives about the set. Let's look at, let's look at the positives. Um, it does have some nice, uh, you know, detailing stickers on the side for the pieces just to continue, like, kind of the gray up into the actual piece. Um, it's a nice transition in the front. It's, like... Um, kind of like well it's supposed to be hovering so um it has like that like a little like st i don't know clear stud thing oh you can't even see on the camera i didn't realize they had kind of that um that clear stud thing on the bottom and with uh, pieces to give it the illusion it's hovering and um i mean it looks pretty good like that has some uh spares on the front uh and um this like little like technic thing right here with just axles to connect it um, at the certain angle, which um, looks pretty good. Uh, look at the back, we have kind of like this long like engine thing and uh, with uh, some handlebars in the front. Also a spot to put your Grievous minifigure, which we can do right now, just to show what that looks like again. Um, you know, if you will actually stop. If you will actually, there we go, got him on. And uh, you just, you know, 
have his arms right there, and uh, he's uh, driving a speeder bike. Um, if you're wondering where the lightsabers went, I actually didn't put them to the side. There's actually a nice spot underneath, which I really appreciate, actually, instead of having to take the lightsabers like apart if you want to put them somewhere. You just have to clip them around to the bottom and then take them out when you're ready to use them again, which is uh, you know, a nice feature, honestly. Uh, there's also two spring-loaded chewers, if you didn't see, you know normal nothing uh, too fancy uh, if you want to put it on display you obviously don't want to have those guys uh, hanging out even though they're not too noticeable if you look from the back or the side you can see them so i mean if you want to i just recommend taking off the basically the, the piece like the little construction where it happens and it looks just fine without it just like so um but that's an easy thing to get rid of uh uh, as you see, it's just basically um, bracket pieces um, connecting it. So uh, yeah, uh, it's a it's a it's a good set, but not a good price. So because of that, it's not gonna be a recommended purchase unless you get it for twenty or below. In my opinion, then it will be a good deal. I mean, it's just a good set for the minifigures. Honestly, Mace Windu and Grievous, you can't go wrong with that. And, uh, I mean, the, the build isn't actually, it, it's, it's decently, uh, fun, you know, it's not, it's not terrible, it's not boring, but it's not fantastic. So, uh, that's gonna be all for this review, guys. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to hit the like button down below and the notification bell. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos from me in the future. But that's gonna be all, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day.